Yeah, hi there, and uh, these comments are for, I'm just going to use your initials, M, and you completed one of my integrated uh, speaking practice tests on my web website, and I am Michael, the founder, owner, and the materials writer for all of your lessons, so let's hear what you have to say. And the listening passage gives two different examples of passage, and the listening passage give two different examples of how can advertising affect people's behavior. You don't want to say how can advertising affect. That's the wrong word order. You want to use statement word order. How advertising affects people's behavior. Noun clauses take statement word order. It means connector plus subject plus verb. First of all, what do you think the passage claims? that the advertising impact on people's behavior as a result of the TV and the radio commercial. No, no, no. When you get to the first point, say, first of all, according to the reading passage, advertising has political effects. That's the way to start that part of the speech because that states what the purpose of the reading passage is. Additionally, advertising can also affect people's decisions to vote for a practical candidate because they know him. So I, I don't think you've talked enough about that f that first idea, you know, the, the political aspects of it. By his advertising campaigns. Second of all, the listening passage gives another example of how can advertising affect... It's how advertising affects. So you don't want to use a question there. ...people's behavior. A consumer by a special product because... I would state there the purpose of the listening passage is to discuss the economic effects of advertising, right? You should state that as you begin explaining the listening passage. ...from he or she sides in the TV. Finally, advertising can affect people's economic and political decisions. Okay, so let's take a look at the rubrics here. Okay, so I think that you did not, comp it, you didn't have an exactly complete response from the reading and the lecture. I think you can better organize uh, your ideas, especially by explaining the main point of the reading and the listening passage. And I think you might have missed some of the key points from both sources. Uh, from a language use perspective, you're having some problems with what's called word order, especially in noun clauses. So if you're not sure about that, go to Google, type in the words word order in noun clauses so you can learn a little bit more about that. Uh, from a pronunciation standpoint, I mean, I can understand most of what you're saying. You have, you have some minor issues with some things here and there. So this one, I'm going to put you at 2.16 out of 4 or 17 points out of 30 on this particular practice test. Now, for the purposes of our class, this is going to give you 75% on this assignment.